Hello, uh, yes, Anne-Marie Waters is playing the persecution card now. She, it's her turn now to uh, play that one. You see, that's been played out before from Adam Walker, Clive Jefferson, Peter Turney, uh, Dawn Charlton, commonly known as Butch Dawn, Mike Whitby, the list is endless, where they've been persecuted, haven't they? Now it's Anne-Marie Waters' turn where people who are posting support in support of the Britain Party being suspended from work, Twitter accounts are being suspended or closed or Facebook, whatever. And it's the same modus operandi. Her fellow traveller, Tommy Robinson's been pulling since 209. He's always getting persecuted, isn't he? And picked on, right? But it's all an act, it's all a scam. It's part of the farce to fool people. But also, also, the main reason for it, I believe, is to scare the bigger public away. It won't scare away the ideologues and the sycophants and those dedicated to the cause. It won't scare them away. No, of course it won't, right? But your average person out there, that's not a thinker, that's just a voter, it will scare them away, as it's intended to. The persecution. You see, there's a few reasons, but there's two that spring to mind. Firstly, it will harden the resolve of the, the members, the ideologues, and the sycophants and whatever, because they don't know no difference in most cases, right? They'll believe the persecution is a uh, genuine and real. But secondly, and most importantly, it will scare away the bigger public. They're thinking, Christ, I'm not going to post any support for that party. I'm going to get suspended. In fact, I'm not going to even have anything to do with it because I'll lose my job. And so on and so on. It's like the Tommy Robinson one where he was helping the, the dinner lady supposedly suspended. Did she get her job back? You see, again, she probably no doubt in on that with Tommy Robinson and the big boys in MI5. You see, that again would is to like strengthen the resolve of the sycophants, ideologues, uh, supporters, members. It will strengthen their resolve to continue, but that's only a tiny, tiny minority of the public. But the bigger public who we need, they'll be scared from it saying, Christ, she's a dinner lady, I'm a professional, I'm a doctor, I'm a nurse, I'm a, I'm a lawyer, I'm a judge or whatever. Christ, I'll most certainly be sacked. Oh, I'm not having nothing to do with anything that's against immigration or the Islamification of Britain. And this is what it's all about. And it's now Anne-Marie Waters' term. You've just seen a screenshot of a Facebook. Someone's been suspended or whatever because they've posted in support of Brit for Britain Party or whatever. And it may be real, it may not be, but she's... She's following the same modus operandi of all those before her. Tommy Robinson in particular. Adam Walker getting persecuted by the education authority. And while it's all part of the scam, as we now know, as even Daphne Griffin now knows, he sacrificed his teaching profession for a new one to take up, which was a professional snitch for the state, a disruptor, an agent provocateur, right? And Daft Nick never, never cottoned on once what was happening. I wonder when the penny dropped, Nick. Was it when they had the extraordinary meeting, was it? When they voted to have a no confidence in you, which then relieved you of your powers as chairman of the BMP and deputy, deputy, that's right, deputy chairman, Adam Walker stepped into your shoes. I wonder if it was only then that the penny dropped. Christ, that is bad. If that is the case, that is bad. Right, and in fact, it must be because you appointed him deputy chairman. You must have really believed all that bollocks he was calling about his persecution. And oh, yes, he wasn't getting persecuted out of the Kokushin Kaikrati organization, was he? Oh, no, like I've said before, even though I can't, but try and imagine Griffin or Tyndall, like I say, even though I couldn't, but anyway, try and imagine Tyndall and Griffin running a Kratty school. How long do you believe they'd last five minutes? before they'd be drummed out. Of course they would, right? But no one got on that at all. And even what's sad about all this, is I warned Nick Griffin year in, year out, what was happening. And still, he took the notice. I'm, I'm lost for words. I'm waiting for an email off you yet. I've never had one since I've uh, started naming and shaming these amateur spooks and especially was, since I've been doing these videos. I've never had one message off you saying, yeah, you're right, Joe. Oh, you're wrong, Joe. Send an email pointing out where I'm wrong and I'll agree with you. But you haven't, you can't because you know I'm right. But anyway, so Anne-Marie Waters, now it's her turn. 
when a party is being persecuted. Uh, people showing support for the party being suspended from work. And like I've said, that's to strengthen the resolve of the naive members, ideologues, sycophants, if, if there is any ideologues these days. That's to uh, strengthen their resolve, right? Because they don't know any different. And it also shows that Anne Marie is this big threat. Uh, Anne Marie Waters, that is, sorry. Uh, it, it shows that Anne Marie Waters then. Is this big threat to the state, which then encourages other people to join who are naive, really believe they're betting the winning horse this time when they're not. And also, it scares away the bigger public. She's now doing what they've all been doing. They're still doing, applying, whatever you want to call it, the modus operandi that I've exposed since 2009 they're still using it that's the word using it they're still using the same modus operandi pretend to be persecuted have the police arrested Tommy Robinson's getting arrested every day what, what for enemy of the state he's part of the state he's achieving zilch what's she achieved tell me nothing just marching up and down the high streets into it a spoon, a few scoops and all back home again. That's not achieving anything. The only way you're changing this is by voting the fuckers out. Okay, thank you.